All right, so when you think of what's what's it like living in the St. John's River, you may think of catfish mm. and bass, you know, what's been around in there. But did you know that you can actually harvest caviar? This is interesting. Learning something new every yeah. day. It's true, and more than just a fun fact, as local researchers say, it helps monitor the health of the river. Caviar coming from sturgeon, which researchers say were once over-harvested and diminished from most of the southeast. And since sturgeon can live up to 30 years, take a long time for them to be old enough to actually produce eggs. Now, if you want to have sturgeon caviar, you have to kill the mother sturgeon to harvest the eggs. But a police officer recently discovered a sturgeon on shore, making researchers uh, like Dr. White with JU say there is a sign they're heading in the right direction to save the species. And it's going to take a long time because you only get one or two females coming in, releasing a few eggs, actually a few hundred thousand eggs. Um, but it takes a long time for those to, to develop. Quentin White there, he adds the best way to protect animals like the endangered sturgeon are by keeping the river clean. And if you fish, best thing to do is catch and release.